What's up guys, this is Tampa Tech, and whether you like to travel in your RV, you're a truck driver, or you're even an Uber, you may be interested in a dash camera. Well, I'm gonna be setting up this dash camera and show you how to use it and the quality of the video. So let's go ahead and get started. It has features as one touch, snapshot, quick button, and uh, instant sharing to Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. No YouTube. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, open it up and see what we got. It's packed in pretty tight. So uh, open it up. <clears throat> oh crap! <laughs> it has a pry tool. This is really great to have if you're installing a car radio. So this is I'm going to keep this for a long time until it breaks. There's the USB. Oh, very nice. Comes with two. So you could charge your phone at the same time. You could plug in your camera. Very thoughtful. And here's the suction cup right here. Ooh, it's a quick lock right here. This thing seems pretty good build quality. Yeah, and you'll look at that little cable holder. Very thoughtful. And here is the micro USB to plug in the um, camera, USB to plug in. Plugs in right here. All right, so it looks like there's a built-in LED right there letting you know that uh, something's charging. This looks like the camera. <laughs> it says step one. <laughs> I started it off with step three. Let's go ahead, step one. I didn't even notice that the um, boxes were labeled step one, two, and three. All right, here it is. This is actually a, looks like a hockey puck. If this ever breaks, I uh, have an extra hockey puck. Uh, there it is, that's where you plug it in to, for the power, the micro SD card for storage, and the reset button in case it freezes up. All right, let's go ahead and open this up. Step two. Ooh, stuck in there really good. There it is. All right, that's it. All right, so this looks like part of the mounting kit to hold the wiring. This is pretty useful, so when you're running it to your cigarette lighter port, here's the little mounts for the cabling. And it looks like, oh, it's magnetic. So that's pretty cool. Look at that. And you can spin it around so you can face it towards you. This is great for Uber drivers. You can face it towards your passenger or toward the road. It tells you how to install it. All right, let's go ahead and download the app. Vava Dash, new 2.0 design, drive on the road with Vava Dash Cam. Very nice, capture life's wonders in 1080p HD. And share them on social networks. Start, and it's magnetic, it shows you the installation guide right here. So it looks like you put this on your dash, uh, actually you put this on your windshield, you push up, I guess that locks it in. Yeah, there we go. Very easy. And then just twist on, and then you gotta adjust it to wherever you wanna aim, probably the outside the windshield. And it looks like you plug it into here. And then you run the cable on this. And then this right here, this tool, is to wedge the wires under the um, seams of your roof, your uh, paneling. And then you plug the car charger into the cigarette lighter port, and then you have an extra port to charge your phone. And this says the output is five volts, 2.4 amps. So I have a power adapter right here, and this is a five volts output, uh, 2.4 amps, which is, uh, this one right here, this port right here. So just plug it into here. Oh, I heard a little chime. It lets you know that it's plugged in. All right. All right, now let's go ahead and let's get connect. All right, the password is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, right here is my snapshots, my looping, and emergency. I guess that's the G sensor, emergency. All right, 
I stay connected, it said. Let's select that, it'll pop up. Oh, cool, look at it. Very, very nice. Cool. It looks like it has a wide angle lens. Oh yeah, it does. It has a wide angle lens so you can see um, everything on the road. That's very smart. There's my snapshot. I'm gonna need a SD card, micro SD card. Uh, so I can't do anything yet. So let me go ahead and get that. All right, and then the resolutions. Here's the, all the resolutions. So you got 480p, 720p, 1080p, 1080p, 60 frames per second, which is uh, ideal. Uh, parking mode, I have that set on. So uh, it'll monitor my car while it's parked. You can mute it if you want to, um, you don't want anyone to hear your voice. So if you have a lot of road rage and you curse a lot in your car, that may be uh, bad to show the cop if you get in a car accident. Watermark, I have the watermark is uh, local time and speed, which is kind of cool. Uh, tells you your speed that you're going. That could be useful in a court of law. So if the cop says, hey, you were speeding, and it shows that you were not speeding using the software, then that might benefit you. And it'll save you a couple hundred dollars on a ticket. And as you can see, when you have it turned toward you, um, you'll be able to see all your passengers behind you, no problem. It records even out the windows. The wide angle lens really covers it, everything. And then when you spin it forwards, it covers both lanes in the highway on the road. I feel the default settings are pretty dead on. So if you found this video informative, give me a big thumbs up. If you guys are interested in this product and you want to buy it, check out the link in the video description below. If you guys want to win this product, I'm doing a giveaway on my Instagram account. Only thing you have to do is follow, like, and comment on that post. And within a week, I'll send a private message to the winner. If you know anyone that may be interested in this device, maybe they a parent that wants to monitor their kids' driving habits, Go ahead and click on the share button below and share this video to them. If you want to check out my other how-to videos, click on this playlist right here. And if you want to subscribe to Tampa Tech for more car tech and how-tos and tutorials, tech reviews, all that stuff, click on this subscribe link right here or the subscribe button down below. Thanks guys for watching.